Local 4 is for family fun, and there's nothing more family friendly than a trip to the zoo. Tomorrow there's an animal art show happening with artwork created by the wildlife. NAMI Zoo Assistant Director Tammy Schmidt joins us now to talk about it. Welcome. Thank you. Okay, so first, uh, tell us about the event. Sounds like fun. You know what? We had no idea we had burgeoning artists all around the zoo. So our keepers do lots of environmental enrichment, and it's enrichment day tomorrow. So we thought, what better way to make a connection with our guests who love art, who love wildlife? Let's marry that, bring it together, and raise some funds. 100% of the proceeds will go to back to buying environmental enrichment for the animals. So you're going to have uh, artist renditions of our snow angel down there, our snow leopard painting. Um, it's a collaborative painting with one of our humans who's a super artist. So you have an, uh, the snow leopard female painted the painting, then our human collaborator came and added a watercolor of her actual portrait. This middle section here is our newest couple at the zoo, Charles and Cleo, our African crusted porcupine. So we call this the spiked hike. And then we have footprints. So we have some animals that donated footprints. And these are our, our mixed primates that uh, Asul and Azizi, we call them A-team affectionately. So you may be able to find some of your favorite animal artists um, have painted and you have a chance to come and buy uh, some at our Oceans Gallery tomorrow, turned Art Gallery. You could buy them anywhere from 10 to 100 bucks. Yeah, and we have a silent auction. So the ones that have the collaborative watercolor, those will be in a silent auction, about 10 or 11 of those pieces. So bid high, bid often. All right, <laughs> tell me, how did the animals actually paint these? So the keepers create a bond with animals over time as they're working with them every day. So we presented them with canvas in some form or fashion, whether it was holding it up to the giraffe so that they could paint with their whole face, or it was the primates putting their, their stamp of approval on canvas. We did find that our Taj is a very, very uh, persnickety, delicate artist, and he didn't like the white canvas. So we painted a, pri a, a like a nice earth tone on it, then he loved it, and he was all about painting. So it's about trusting their keepers, and interacting with their keepers and it's really a cognitive activity where they are thinking about what the paint smells like, what it feels like and how it feels when they put all of that together on canvas. It's non-toxic paint, it's all their choice. They can walk away when they want to um, and most of the time we found that everybody really was into it. Yeah, you can kind of see the tails like from yes. the porcupines on there. Yes, you can see the drag of the spine, uh, the quills from the porcupine. How long does each painting take? Does it depend on the animal? It depends on the artist, yeah. Some of them, we have a goat named Alana who loves it so much that she's got one done in five minutes, whereas some others who, this was a tag team effort by Charles and Cleo, so they took their time with it and it probably took maybe 15 minutes, so it just depended. And each of the paintings does come with a certificate of authenticity mm -hmm. and a bio of the animal with a picture of them um, at the bottom for your kids or your family members. Great Christmas presents. I'm going to have a hard time not wanting to <laughs> buy it all and take it home with me. I know. They look very impressive. They're super fun. Yeah. They're super fun. They're happy. Um, and it's a good way for us to relate to the animals and talk about the animals and talk about all the different aspects of enrichment. We are opening at 10 o'clock tomorrow. The art show goes through 4. But we're all day long activities with our enrichment. Uh, our education department is planned some fun activities. And we have fun enrichment throughout the zoo. All right. Well, Tammy, thank you so much for coming thank in. Thank you for having us. And again, uh, the Animal Art Show is tomorrow from 10 to 4 at the Oceans Gallery at Nabby Zoo. We have more details about the event at our website, arquadcities.com.